Well, I sat down with Leangelo and his father, LeVar, in their brand new Chino Hills home outside of Los Angeles. And Leangelo opened up about why he is leaving UCLA and for the first time gave the inside story of what really happened in China last month. We all went out one night, uh, went through the malls, went through, went to a Louis Vuitton store, and uh, he's, people started taking stuff. And then, you know, me just not thinking and being with him, I took something too. But Leangelo Ball had a feeling the sunglasses he didn't pay for were going to be a costly mistake. And we left thinking we'll just get away. You know how kids think. I didn't realize till I got back to my hotel. I'm like that. That was stupid, but. By then it was too late and then sure enough, the next morning the, the police came and got us. You spent the night in jail? Uh, we, were, we were in jail for a day and a half or something like that. What was that like? Oh, it was horrible. They take your clothes, you wear them, um, like whatever they have for you, a little jumpsuit or whatever. Take your shoestrings and then you just sit in a cement cell for however long. It's just you and then all the officers and they don't speak English. Leangelo was one of three UCLA freshmen accused of shoplifting. A week later, Chinese authorities dropped the charges and the players returned to the U.S. after President Trump spoke with China's president. I'd also like to thank President Trump and the United States government for the help that they provided. But Leangelo's father, LeVar Ball, has been less polite towards the president. I'll just be saying thank you because somebody said they did something. And if they did it genuinely, do you really need to come up to me and say, boy, you better thank me? He inspired a Trump tweet storm, the president calling LeVar Ball an ungrateful fool and suggesting he should have left the players in jail. But LeVar, ever the promoter, attempting some sneaker diplomacy. You did send President Trump some baller shoes. I sent him three pair, red, white, and blue, to show him we patriotic. Leangelo has decided to leave UCLA rather than sit out the team's stiff suspension for the shoplifting incident. Two to three months being suspended, that was too long for you to wait? Yeah, that's, that's the whole season pretty much. And that's just a long time of doing nothing. I'd rather be playing. China already said, okay, he made a bad mistake. We're going to drop the charges. That's the punishment they gave him. But in China for stealing, you But that's the punishment they gave years. him. Now we over here. Look, at, we got to serve some more punishment? He apologized. What is the long process for? We only went to UCLA, one and done, to play basketball. Now LeVar plans to take Leangelo's future into his own hands. I'm going to get Jello in shape. I'm going to work him out. We're going to do some other things, and he's going to be headed to the NBA. All these boys are going to get on the Lakers. Watch how I do this. And people are going to look up and they say, wow, how they all get on the Lakers? I just want to play, period. I mean, I'm not worried about money. And playing with Zoe and Melo are playing with my brothers in L.A., that's like paying me right there, really, just being able to play with them. No matter what happens, LeVar Ball and his family say they are only looking forward. What's your fallback plan? I ain't got no fallback plan, because if I got a fallback plan, that means I'm going 80 percent this way and 20 percent to my fallback. I'm 100 in, so I never get stopped. <laughs> Well, Leangelo, for his part, is very remorseful about the incident in China. LeVar, though, as the promoter, says there is a positive. Leangelo no longer is a student athlete bound by NCAA rules, so the family's big baller brand is planning now to debut a shoe in his honor, the G3. I was there when Leangelo saw his sneaker for the first time. It was quite a moment. It will cost you, though, 500 bucks a pop. Guys, back to you. Wow. Forever promoting him. Yeah. Natalie. Always. Thanks, Nat. Thank you. Hello, Today fans. Thanks for checking out our YouTube channel. Subscribe by clicking that button down there and click on any of the videos over here to watch the latest interviews, show highlights, and digital exclusives.